Tears of the Kingdom has finally been released, after years of anticipation. So today, we have something truly special to celebrate the long-awaited release of Tears of the Kingdom, but with the twist. In the spirit of Mermaid, where artists dive into creating enchanting mermaids throughout May, we're going to do a crossover. Imagine we combine the captivating world of Tears of the Kingdom with the delightful sea themes twist. We scoured the depths of inspiration and stumbled across this image of sea glass with the perfect palettes for this creation. And so, our chosen character emerges. None other than Link himself, transformed into a magnificent mermaid. Bringing these two worlds together, we harmonize their palettes carefully matching each shade that goes with this feature as best. The vibrant green palette of the new game complements our design flawlessly, adding an intriguing touch compared to the blue tones in Breath of the Wild. Just to make our vision a bit clearer, we erase some of the background. Although the chosen palette leans towards a monochromatic scheme, we tweak some hues and values to enhance the overall appeal infusing our design with captivating interest. Now it's time for the first stage of rendering, with shading and adding highlights to bring out the distinct features of our mermaid's link, ensuring each element stands out beautifully.
As we move into the second stage, we delve into the details that make our design truly authentic. We've decided to give Link a siren-like appearance, adding scales to his face and seaweed to his body to add an extra layer of intrigue. With the final stages of rendering and cleanup, our design begins to shine. If you've reached this point, make sure to subscribe and leave a comment below suggesting what we should bring to life next. And with that, here is the final result. We made some tweaks to the colours and added some glow for the final touch. What do you think of how this turned out?